everyone, welcome back. Chelsea here from Chelsea Paints. Today I'm gonna to do another pendulum. We are going to try for a different pattern today. First, we are using the exterior semi-gloss uh, white paint from Bear. And I have the setup up here. The carabiners, there's four attached to one eye hook and then four more on the other eye hook. So hopefully this will give us the square pattern that we're looking for if our calculations are correct. So let's see what happens. Okay, so today I have blue house paint. I'm gonna try to keep my pattern on my piece of wood. I have a three by six piece of wood that I painted uh, with white house paint. So let's see if I can keep it on there. Right, so we definitely got some squares in here. For those of you who say this is easy, it is not. <laughs> but we did get some squares. I went off the canvas, I was trying not to, but you know. So I'm gonna try to do a circle one now with some red paint right here next to it. This one is not bare. This one is Valspar Season Flex Exterior some kind of red, it's like a coral red. So anyways, um, this is my smaller cup. So I do have a little bit bigger hole in the bottom. Um, so yeah, let's see what happens. Okay, here we go. Trying for the circular pendulum this time.
okay guys well that was a fun experiment <laughs> i definitely got the circle and the square pendulums that i was going for um, as you can see this red one has a lot thicker lines that cup had a bigger hole so you see a lot more meshing on that one um, for the square pendulum i used the cup that had the smaller hole that's why these lines are so much thinner than the other one. So you see the square inside the square inside the square. That's exactly the look I was going for. Pretty proud of this one, circle and square, both on the same sheet of wood. Let me know what y'all think.